Hi guys and welcome back to Potion Craft. It is our, I actually don't know which day, it is our third day, <laughs> that's what it is, um, in the game. And let's see, how have we been doing on this alchemist's path? So we need to learn a new talent and reach a popularity of two. Alright, we are learning as we're going. We've had a couple, you know, mishaps, made a few mistakes. But that's all part of the fun, just figuring out the game. Um, so we've collected our morning's ingredients. Let's see what our customers are looking for. Greetings. I recently went fishing at a lake in the forest. I cast my line out and immediately got a bite. I reeled it in and tried to get it off the hook, but that fish had some teeth. It bit me on the palm and flopped back in the water. Now my hand is all swollen. How can I fish now? So I'm going to assume that you need um, a potion of healing. I am wondering if there's a way for us to brew... I'm still trying to figure out the, the stronger qualities. I think it might have to do with the accuracy of hitting the little potion circle. But for now, we're going to stick with this. Um, hopefully this is good enough for them. They seem quite happy with that. We're going to haggle. We're going to need to be boosting our funds. I don't know if we made a boost, <laughs> if we made much more on there, but um, seemed like a couple passes was enough. Might have to try to do go a little bit further with it next time. I finished digging up stumps on my field and was planning to burn them to fertilize the soil to ash, but then as luck would have it, it started raining today and the stumps all got soaked. I need to plow the field this week. Burn them. Stumps are soaked. Ma'am. Do you need a fire potion? Hmm. It started raining. It was... Okay, do you need... No, you don't need light. Okay, let's try a fire potion next for her. Um... A little expensive in terms of the fire bloom. I'm thinking, okay, because we actually want to get a little bit higher on here, I'm gonna crush this until we get to the highest point. Over there, throw it in, let's move ourselves along. And from here, we'll crush these fully to get us the distance that we want. Seems... Seems pretty alright. No, 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 I didn't want... No, I didn't want that. Of course not. I, I want to stir. Okay, one. Can I get a two? Can I? Ah, uh, no, not good enough for a two. But we tried, and if it was made. Okay. And. Oh, we, we got the poof, right? Yeah. Got distracted for a second, but there we go. Finished. Okay. Fire. Yep, that is what she wanted. Okay, so sometimes well, when you hear hooves, think horses, not zebra, basically. Okay. To the haggling. Oops. One more pass. Oh shoot. I don't think we I misclicked too many times. Um, but it's fine. I have so many cares and worries each day. I wash, I cook, I shop, I look after the children. I can spend all day on my feet and not sit down to rest once because of that my feet are covered in calluses and corns. Perhaps you have a remedy for them. I guess that would also be healing. Right, I can't think of... Um, well, no, not, not a healing again. The last one was fire. Now we want a healing potion here. If I look at our recipe book, this one. 
This is a weak potion of healing. This is a weak potion of poisoning. So let's try and hit this better this time. Uh, tricky to say which direction we should be going in. No, this green mushroom could make for a good healing potion. Hmm. I think we're going to try good old terraria and water bloom. So, let's crush them up. It's almost the exact same recipe that we used last time. I want to get a little more south though. She probably just wants a mine up. Mm, maybe I'm overdoing it. She, I think she, I mean, she just wants a mine, a potion. I don't think we need to go too crazy actually. Interesting. Um, all right, we're just gonna do the same potion we already had actually. So we really, this was the recipe we could have just gone from that, but now we got to do it ourselves by hand. Okay. Let's finish that. Uh, ma'am. Good enough? Yep, she likes it. Okay, let's try and make a little bit more of a profit. Okay. Are we getting more for that? I, my attention span is so short. <laughs> I keep forgetting. Okay, it's nice to see a few new faces in these parts. I suppose you're the new alchemist, a wonderful one, the local mushroomer. If you're an alchemist, then you must know the quality ingredients when you see them. A few mushrooms here, we take a look. Anything besides mushrooms? Nope. Show me your goods. Okay, I see some overpriced ones. We will not consider those. Got a chanterelle and a red mushroom. Do we have any chanterelles? We do. We've got one. Um, so. We don't have any of these red mushrooms. And a red mushroom. Okay, let's see. So these. Okay. So this one. This, this one takes us right. Then this one takes us left. Okay. Um, I don't want to mess up the haggling now. Hmm. Really cool looking mushrooms, but they're just, they're just so expensive, so. We're just, we're just going to take the one and we're just going to give it a go. Miss click. Last pass. Oh. Yeah, that's okay. That, that went a little better. Right? Save seven coins. Not mad about that. Hello, a very strange guest came to our hotel. He says he has a great fear of fire and even refuses to use candles. However, he still demands light in his room. Okay, ma'am. I think we got something for you right on hand. Cool, let's haggle again. Gotta make that money. We are entrepreneurs. Good enough. <laughs> I don't know if they're winning our favor or against our favor when I'm editing. I'm going to go back and look at this. Um, three robbers attacked me yesterday. They wanted my money, but they couldn't find anything. Gave me a good beating instead. But I did have money on me. I just hid it in a safe place. But now I have to spend money on a healing potion. My whole body aches. All right, so we're going to give you one straight out of the recipe book. Um, looks like we do have what we need here. Here you go. Okay, haggling, starting price of 10. No, I just clicked sell. Oh my goodness, what's wrong with me? Okay. 
Well, hello, I heard there was a new alchemist in town, so I came to say hi. I'm the local sorceress, or witch if you like. So that's what the locals call me. Anyway, uh, I didn't just come by out of curiosity. Do you happen to carry poison in your shop? Aquatavana. Why would a witch need poison? Sometimes our witch recipes call for poison and human blood. But I'll get that myself somehow. Haha. <laughs> Okay, um, poison. We do have a poison potion on us. Will this do it for you? Starting sale price of 12. We're gonna haggle and we wanna see more. We wanna see closer to 14. Uh, there we go, 14. Perfect. Okay, and that ended that day. Cool. So I guess it is time for us to go to bed. Beautiful sequence, got the windmill going and everything. Okay, as usual, sort of our day in the garden. Let's make sure we're getting everything we can out of here. You need to take a good look. I don't want to miss anything. All right, customers. Hello, I see you recently opened. I'm also an alchemist, but I'm just passing through town. I'm collecting some ingredients and selling alchemy equipment, so I decided to drop in. I'm running light right now and only have enchanted paper with me. But if you need to expand your recipe book, you can buy a couple sheets. Aha, enchanted paper. The sheets in the recipe book are made of special enchanted paper. The enchantment slows down the paper's aging and allows you to edit existing recipes. You can even completely erase an old recipe and write a new one instead. In addition, sheets of enchanted paper can be conveniently bound into the recipe book, allowing you to expand it almost indefinitely. Show me your goods, sir. 200 smackers for some enchanted paper. We're not out of space yet. So, um, I'm going to end dialogue. Thanks, buddy, but we don't need your services just yet. Greetings, I had a brilliant idea yesterday. To brew a beer that warms your bones even on the coldest days. People would pay a pretty penny for it in the northern provinces. The recipe is almost ready, but for the beer to always be warm, I need something like liquid fire. So we can definitely help you with that. We do not have a saved recipe for that because we're still perfecting it. Um, but I think we pretty much know what our recipe is going to be. Um, we will do three fire bell. I'm just trying to think of a way. Another one that moves left. This one. But... Okay, if, they, if someone says, like, hey, I want a strong one, then that is when. Maybe if I do, like, each one almost to the edge. Let's see. Do another. Because we just want, we want to climb up a little each time. Yeah, now we're not quite going to make it all the way in. But let's try this. We're going to hit that. Okay, it's still just the one. But vertically lined up a little bit better. Um, right. Time to see what we got cool now let's play around with this a little bit what, what do we want what type of label should this have um we do oh that's the rotation of the entire label nope we'll do the we'll do that okay so now this is going to be a weak potion. Oh, that's so tiny. It's so cute. Oh, huh? 
How cool is that? This one is actually a flame. It's a very big bottle, though. I do like that. I mean, what else would you use the the fiery shaped bottle for, if not that? Um, maybe that label's a bit better. Uh, what colors? We want like a big fiery red. Not too sure. I mean, the original colors are, are pretty apt, if you ask me. So maybe we will stick with that for this potion. I think that's quite fun looking. Very big bottle. Very big bottle. Mm, it probably would be better off for like a, a sort of like a major potion. But until we have those, we'll stick with this. So let's go back. So this is going to be a fun bottle to throw. Imagine we could get this one to stand on its tip. That would be fun. Don't know how long I want to try this for. Come on, bottle. Okay, you know what? Unlikely to happen. But the sound is also kind of cool. Good times. So, to suit your needs? Yes. Okay, we're gonna haggle. So we want to get like a plus three. Oh shoot. I messed it up pretty quickly. Okay, there we go. I think we got the maximum boost there. We're selling it for... What else do you add to beer? Actually, the recipe for my beer is a big secret. All I can say is I add five types of fiery peppers to this one. Interesting. Okay, there's your potion. Please help. My son was playing with friends in the forest and twisted his ankle jumping from a tree. Okay, so she needs a healing potion. I'm going to assume that's what she needs. While we're here, let's change this potion up a bit. So, what would I imagine a healing potion to look like? Healing potion. See, do we put heart in a heart? Makes me think of more like a, a love potion. That's kind of cute for a for a weak healing potion. I think that's a cute, a cute look. Oh wow! Look at these like pre-colored ones. They're so fun. Oh my goodness. Oh, so cool. Oh, we should put a skull and crossbones on the poison one. Beautiful colors. The nail. Oh, that's super cool. Like luck potions, maybe. Oh, this, you see, now this makes me think more of healing. Right? Like this would be more of like love potion. But this, 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 would, this gives me healing vibes. Okay, we're gonna go with that. Um, I think we're more like this. Tall bottle could be fun. Looks a bit like honey. Looks like a perfume. Maybe something like that. Yeah, I think that's a good look. You know, red and the green and everything. Not too bad. I like that. Okay, let's brew this recipe. Ma'am, your healing potion. Let's haggle. not doing too bad <gasps> as I say that I start messing up okay there we 
we got the we got the full thing. I don't know how long ago we got the full thing, but we did. Children who wander into the forest to play by the lake have started going missing of late. The villagers are certain it's a merman. I've been asked to deal with him, to deal with the beast. To reinforce my sword, defeat the scum. I hear merman, flee at the sound of thunder. at the sound of thunder stone skin mana flee at the sound of thunder found stone skin down here any correlation pone and um, poison <laughs> pone <laughs> poison stone maybe it's up here somewhere the icon water New potion bases can be purchased from... Aha, so the potion base is water and that's where this sort of gets us. I don't know how we can squeeze through here. I feel like we've got more room to play around up here. Because I feel like... You know... The... The skull things are coming through there, and I don't know what these swirls are yet. But I also do kind of feel like light and thunder might be on the same trajectory. Ah, uh, it's daring. You know what? For science sake, I think we are gonna go straight through that. Let's see what best equips us to go in that direction. We don't actually have very much that's more of an angle for that direction. So I guess we're gonna go. Oh, you know what? We're we're not spoiled for um, Firebell, which is the only one that moves us right. Okay, but we've got quite a bit of water bloom, which is going to. I mean, this one moves us left. This one moves us right. So we've got no, we've got quite a bit of water bloom, which will move us right. And then we've got the wind bloom which will move us up. So because of what ingredients we have, I think heading towards the northeast is our best choice of direction for experimentation. Go over there. Heading up. Water bloom. Again. Really find these swirls curious. Nothing really seems to happen to us when we get close. Okay, let's continue up. Unless there's like a bone right there. Oh, I see a potion. To our left. I don't know what this icon does. If we click that reset, all the ingredients you use will be lost. No. Um, it's not going to get us very close, but we need to see what this potion is. So. What? to do it will get us across to there we use a fire bloom to get us across and then a terraria to get us down keep a little bit of extra height um terraria what was your velocity okay this can move you you know, this is going to curve us. Hopefully we'll be alright. We've kept, we tried to keep a little bit of height. Okay, wish us luck. It's not the end of the world, we're going to throw that. No, we can actually, we can, whoop, almost too far. Brew it a little bit.
gentle. Okay. Oh, I don't want to push it. Okay, it's okay. This is gonna get. Okay, let's see. What are you? Lightning. You no, know, I hope that might be potion that we need. Hey, look how look, wow, all that thinking and it actually paid off. We got super lucky there. Oh, okay. Well, sir, this potion was very hard to make and it was very expensive. We are definitely haggling. We want the optimal value for that. So, up to a possible like 51 is what we're aiming for. There we go, 51. We got it. Almost worth it. <laughs> so many ingredients. Okay. Who else do you sell herbs to? A lot of people need herbs in town. Some use them as seasoning, others for medical medicinal purposes. And the brewers... The brewer is often using them to brew new kinds of beer. Show me your goods. Okay. Not a bad price for fire bloom. Uh, this? Wow. So expensive. We haven't seen this one before. I kind of want to get two of those. Let's get another tangleweed. Are we doing what? You know what? We are a bit short on fire bloom. I am gonna. I'm gonna want two more. And now, let's see what we can do. If we haggle, we could get a pretty good deal. quite how much we saved there but I think we saved quite a bit and I think I did enough passes I don't know if going back and forth much more was going to help us so it's a deal nice um that's it let's end this dialogue hi there I was heading to my unit's rendezvous point when I saw your shop I thought I'd stop in and buy a potion for our battle mage um his magical powers have waned well I'm going to assume we need a, a mana potion. Though likely we had one. <gasps> oh, we did not do good there. Let me try and get this back up. Okay, hopefully we did alright there. A massive antel appeared near my house and now ants are everywhere on the floor, on the wall, on the ceiling and even in the food. It's unbearable. Needs something to get rid of those annoying bugs and fast. Sir, do, would you like to poison the ants? Well now is the opportunity to, to change the poison bottle. I feel like this is a spooky sort of edge to it. It would probably be good for poison. Can we, we can change the bottle. No, this is like the little drops on its color. No, no. I would like a skull and crossbones on our poison. I think that suits it far better. And yeah, I guess let's brew this recipe. Yep, it seems to be what he wanted. Current selling price 12. There we go. Goodbye. Be afraid to give me a healing remedy on the strongest side. Some guys and I were escorting a trade caravan. Got attacked by bandits. Okay. Healing potion. Stronger side. So, typically, we would get like a little bit far north on the potion, right? 
I'm gonna try get lower using a water bloom so first off terraria we're going to use you to go all the way down um how are we going to do this throw you in don't know if this will work oh it's gonna take us right like now it's, we're gonna go right over the top of it not much more we can do I'm afraid this might have made it even worse okay we've gotten ourselves into It's just just on the edge all right backtracking oh we'd have to use a little bit selfish shelf what else do we have what are our options It honestly just doesn't seem worth it to me. This ingredient... Did we buy this? I don't think we bought it. We probably grew it. You know what? Let's give it a go. This could be very risky for us. Could be quite the waste, but we're gonna try it. It's all about learning. Can we get even stronger? Seems like that's as good as we're gonna get it. Um, just straight potion of healing. Seems. Let's finish that up. Let's go back. So this is the strongest I got. Cool. He Seventeen, sir. Sir, do you know what I went through for that potion? You were gonna be paying more for that. Eighteen. <laughs> Wouldn't look crazy at the end. I think it cost us a bit, but you know what? Extra is extra. No new ingredients. No. All right. Off to bed for us. Well, guys, I'm gonna be ending this part off over here. Hope that you enjoyed. If you did, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.